Hello, my lovely YouTubers. Welcome to the channel of the Loquacious One. How is everyone doing? I hope everyone is fine. This is Loquacious One, the one hit a quitter of affordable hauls, snagging, trending bargains. Okay, I like to welcome everybody to my channel. Thank you for being curious enough to view. I don't do the editing, the soundtracks, all that nice, great stuff because I'm on a time constraint. Plus, I'm too busy shopping, but I guarantee you the contents of my video will vastly improve once time is available. But right now, I just don't have any. So all my ride diaries, thank you for hanging in there with me and being patient because I'm sure I'm sounding redundant. But you understand, everyday life being what it is just does not afford me to do what I always want to do. So today's haul will be... Exclusively from Burlington. I like Burlington for getting um, home accessories and stuff. A lot of stuff that trends at Z Galleries and Wayfarers and all those stores. I can find them at Burlington at a very nice price. So with further ado, because this haul is going to be um, a couple of home decor items and beauty products. Okay, so let me first start with this candle by Parker Hill. It is a Burt. Bark handcrafted candle and look at it. It is so lovely. It is really, really huge compared to smaller ones I've seen. This I got on clearance at Burlington and it's tied with twine wick $7.99. They had a couple. I should have grabbed them, but I didn't. But I plan to use this as a um, decor piece, perhaps. If you had a fireplace uh, mantle or on the heath part of the um, fireplace, this would be lovely. I plan on getting a couple of more and do a grouping, but this was such an awesome price at $7.99. I just jumped on it really quick. They had two. I should have got both of them. I perhaps will, but I want a variegated uh, candle effect with this, so that's why I got the one. Next, I got this um, beautiful box. It is actually a jewelry box. And it is by, oh, excuse me, Nanette Lepore. And it was regularly um, $12.99. And I got it on clearance for $6.99. It's black lacquer with a gold band down the center. Here is the mirror and the removable tray which you can hold rings and miscellaneous piece of jewelry and here on the ledge you can see you can store something at the bottom this is quite lovely or you can use it without the insert and simply have it on one of your um, venues be it your um, coffee table council table bookcase or whatever excuse the fingerprints because you know my hands I got lotion so they're always quite greasy. All right, so I thought that was cute. I'm looking for a larger size. I'm going to try to check another Burlington because I like double stacking my boxes. So those are the two home cord pieces I got. Next, I'll be coming up with the stuff I found in the beauty aisle of Burlington's. Okay, continuing on, here are some of the beauty products I got. They were great at a great reduced price. As far as beauty apparatuses, I found this. Um, it's by Pro Tools for My Beauty Spot. By My Beauty Spot, I'm sorry. It's a jade, and I'm going to butcher this name, a jade... I cannot even pronounce this. I'm not going to even try. G-U-A-S-H-A. -A, facial Stone Massager. Okay. By My Beauty Spot. So if you know how to spell this. I know how they use it. It, visually, it claims to visually lift and contour the face. It promotes brighter complexion. Improving skin's natural radiance. And generally they have this. With a jade roller too. Which. Um. Burlington had, but I didn't need it because I already have a jade roller, and this was two dollars and ninety nine cent. So it's just an awesome deal. So it kind of saves on me trying to purchase this by mail. 
it saves on shipping. So if I try it and don't like it, I'll so have the convenience of taking it back. But I heard great reviews. If nothing else, it massages the face, so that's good enough. I don't expect huge results from it. It's not that invasive, but it's something you could do to maintain and to relax the skin. Another thing I found by Zoe Ayler, it is this um, micro needling derma roller, 0 0.5 millimeters. It says rejuvenate your skin, and it looks like this. I am not using it for that. I'm using it actually for my uh, thinning edges. So I'm a micro needle it, and when I apply my treatment, it should be able to penetrate. I have a micro needle for my face, but I needed a separate one, and this was the right price because it was only two dollars and ninety nine cent, as well as I told you this was two ninety nine. Okay, then going over in skincare, I love Nivea products. They had some deodorant that was um, on clearance for ounces, pure and natural. It's zero percent aluminum free because I prefer that with 48 ounce protection. And it was this is not on clearance, but it was $3.99, as well as they had Pearl and Beauty Quick Dry. Uh, the order and a person for four ounces, it was $3.99 also. Because on some days when I really need extra protection, say like a meeting or a public appearance, I will use a little aluminum just for extra security. Okay. Because you just never know. And for sunscreen, sunscreen, when you, everyone, first of all, should use sunscreen. Okay. At least a minimum SP 15 but if you're African American your skin has a built-in SPF of 15 so I need more therefore I try to do 30 and up minimum and I there are controversial reports about high SPFs and skin cancer that it may cause or whatever I don't know what that is you can do the research but I generally try to stay at 30 when I go out in full force sun such as a day at the beach or a park or camping or something, I will do a SPF of 50 to 800. But this I found was Copper Tone Clearly Sheer SPF 30, a broad spectrum UVA, UVB um, protection, 5 ounces, it won't cause breakouts. It's lightweight and breathable, which I like, and it was on clearance for $2.99. Great deal. These are in the store, and they definitely cost more. So when I can get uh, sunscreen and sunblocks psh, for a good decent price I will because it's a better quality than Dollar Tree and um, just also they'll save you a ton of money this the can was slightly dinner so don't mind that I didn't it's the last one is Neutrogene Ultra Sheer Body Mist Sunblock SPF 30 with Heliplex Broad Spectrum UVA UVV with weightless clean feel ultra light mist non greasy waterproof number one dermatologist recommended sun care five ounces and it was on clearance two for two dollars and ninety nine cent. Now this is controversial because people always talking about they don't use feminine products but I love Queen V um, products I I normally get mine at Walmart and I never got this because. It wasn't necessarily essential, but I picked it up because it was just $2.99. And it is Spray Bay Bay Organic Aloe Base Intimate Moisturizer Spray. So that was a deal, although it did not have the cap. And it probably was there, but I did not look for it. I just grabbed it. Okay. Now, continuing on with some... Um, Nutritional support, I found this by um, Hardy Naturals Fresh and Healthy. I'm going to butcher this name too. It's an Ayurvedic um, product. It's Ash Waganda, I guess, if I'm pronouncing it correctly. And it's four ounces. It is USDA Organic Non-GMO Project Verified. And it was $3.99. I also got this Simply Super Organic 
It's a superfood. It's a cacao powder. And it's six ounces. Again, organic, G, non GMO, verified. And it was $3.99. And just to give you a brief synopsis on the cacao, it's like a chocolate powder. The difference between that and the cocoa bean is the cacao is cold pressed from the bean. The cocoa bean is uh, roasted. Okay, so that's the difference with that. And I'm, I'm simply using it to add to my smoothie shakes and wherever I want a sort of chocolate flavor. I also got this Terra Soul Superfood Maca Powder. It's organic, nutrient, nutrient dense, non GMO verified. It's raw, six ounces, uh, and USDA organic. This comes in several colors, several types of product such as capsules, powder, what have you. Uh, caveat um, tour on this um, is generally perceived to be safe. Again, I'm not a nutritionist, a doctor, a physician, bariatric specialist, or any of those things. But I am simply giving information for things I use. Um, a lot of my wonderful subscribers have gave me warnings on things I have not, I did not previously research the side effects of. Okay, so I try when I possibly can to do that again do the research yourself consult your medical practitioner this maca powder I everybody use it for different things I'm using it for energy blah 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 to add to my smoothies but the warning is again I'm not a doctor if you have any type of thyroid issue or wherever the thyroid is compromised this is considered to be sort of like a goitin that it is coriferous it is related to the broccoli cabbage flowers and they do impact the thyroid so if you have thyroid Please look up um, things you should and should not eat. Um, I'm just telling you offhand, if you have a thyroid issue, you shouldn't be cooking in nonstick pans. You shouldn't be consuming raw uh, vegetables such as cabbage, broccoli, and cauliflower because they do uh, produce goitins and that will impair your thyroid. So again, do the research, ask the doctor, and look that up. Uh, things you should and shouldn't do to maintain your thyroid. Because it's essential. And last but not least, by uh, Simply Super Organic Superfood, this organic moringa powder, six ounces. And uh, it is also USDA organic, non GMO project verified. And this cost me $5.99. And again, I use these to put in my smoothies. And um, the only thing I would tell you is that you really have to watch out for maca. Cacao is like chocolate, but if you have sensitivity to that, again, I'm not a medical practitioner. Moringa, couldn't tell you one way or the other. I just researched it for me, and it was, you know, known to be okay. This ashwagandha, whatever, however you pronounce this. It's something new. I heard great results with it. I didn't have to see any caveat on tours with it. So I will be trying that. Okay. And that is it. That is all. That's all I got on my Burlington haul. Yeah. Check out the home goods section. The clearance section. Uh, again, they have wonderful boxes. Things that trend. I'm going to stack these. Awesome candles that I got. As well as my superfood supplements, my beauty tools, two ninety nine for this micro needler. I'm not going to use it on my face, but simply where I want um, serums and treatments to penetrate better. And this ghee, I believe it's a ghee or something, jade stone, which is good for massaging the face. Again, awesome prices. Everything basically two ninety nine. Deodorant, I got aluminum and non aluminum, and I love Nivea brand. As well as I got sunscreen. Again, these are $2.99. And, of course, this personal spray moisturizer. That's aloe base, $2.99. The deodorants are $3.99. Uh, okay. All right, folks. That's it. That's all. For my little haul, please click the subscribe button. Thumbs up this video if you enjoyed it. Share if you're on social media. Okay. If you joined the contest and you know someone else who might be interested, I greatly appreciate it. If you have any questions, cares, comments, or concerns, leave them in the box below. Till the next time, this is the loquacious one. Bye-bye.